Hey guys, I'm uh, Byron here, doing another figure review, this time on Chibi Masters Super Saiyan Blue Kaioken Son Goku from Dragon Ball Super. Another of the three figures I got, what's called last week, on my trip, and looking pretty nice in design and all that, as you can see right here, move this, move the uh, box right, you can see right here, Kaioken Super Saiyan Blue Goku is pretty nicely designed for a Chibi figure, right now this is the box, which looks pretty nice. Overall, the box looking good, and here are the five figures you can attain for this. As I had last video I made, now you know that I'm missing only two, Trunks and Piccolo, so next time around, and hopefully if I see them, I will probably pick them up. But, out of that way, let's do the unboxing of this, which, for these figures, it's always one little tape piece right here. I kind of want them to always have like three or four, just to make sure uh, there's nobody trying to steal these and whatnot. Overall, box is pretty nice and easy. Got them out of the box, and overall, ooh, look at that. Looking pretty nicely designed right there with Super Saiyan Blue uh, Kaioken Goku. I will say this, uh, something I am probably going to do later, at least for a later review, at least for when I'm doing customs. I usually don't do customs with figures, but I do. Because uh, I kind of want them to have the effect parts. Ooh, look at this. Goku going Super Saiyan Blue. Not going to lie, I kind of wished... Uh, Kinda wish there was like a Super Saiyan uh, Red. No wait, there is Super Saiyan Red with a space, uh, Super Saiyan God. Uh, but I'm hoping to get one of those later on in the line. But overall it's actually pretty nicely designed. Goku right here. Uh, color details all pretty nice. The detail work on the muscles and all that looks pretty good. On the, on the shirts and all that, boots looking good. The face actually looks pretty uh, nice in detail. Hair looks actually pretty nice and glossy right there. I re actually really do like it. Looks pretty nice. Overall, the figure is pretty nice, especially for uh, one of the um, standing. Ooh, and it can stand on its own without its stand. As right now, I'm actually going to be working on the stand at the moment. Just going to do a little bit of the cutting up right here. As it does have a piece of tape right here on the stand part, so I got to knock that tape out. But, oh no. <clears throat> Don't worry, I got it. Got the little stand here. Let me actually put away the knife because I don't want to stab myself. I've had that happen way too many times when I'm doing model kit when I'm, when I'm doing custom builds. I don't need I don't need an incident with my finger. Okay, pretty nice. Okay, now let's see where this goes. And this right here attaches, stands right here, attaches to the back. You see right there there's the hole right there. So just gotta slowly attach. And boom! Now he's on the stand, looking pretty nice on his little tiny stand right there. So now you can have him on display for whenever you, wherever you want to put him. For me, I'm probably going to leave him here on my desk because the rest was uh, where I have Super Saiyan 3 uh, Goku over there. But overall, look at the figure. It's nicely well detailed. It looks pretty nice. The paint job's actually pretty good comparably for, compared to other figures that you usually buy for on cheap. Uh, what's it called? This figure right here only costs me like 10 bucks at Target. So pretty nice deal and whatnot. So if you're trying to start yourself or trying to get back starting Dragon Ball Collection and whatnot, these are actually a good figure set. Like all, all like what's called all five of them together. It's I think full, total 50 bucks. But 50 bucks for like these figures is pretty nice. What's called? I love it. What's called? Uh, I love the coloring and all that. The blue hair, the glossiness, the on the on uh, Goku's on clothes and whatnot, the shininess of the red to make the effect like he's going Kaioken, it's actually pretty nice. Uh, I actually do have particle effect parts, this is going to be later down the line in another video when I'm doing like figure uh, customs and whatnot with the particle effect parts, but that's later down the line. Um, this is the review for Super Saiyan Blue Kaioken uh, Son Goku, uh, thank you for everybody for watching, if you like this video please like, subscribe, and comment. I would very much appreciate it. And it's Pyro Arden signing out. And I'll see you guys on the next one.